Turkey. <laughs> yes, welcome to Turkey. Rome wasn't built in a day, and Turkey will not be exploded in a day. I have absolutely no idea what this is. Very busy, very popping, very heaving. Oh, I'm gonna get it. Okay, not this time. Hi. Meow. <laughs> Okay, guys, we are at the airport on the way to Turkey. Yeah, it's raining, so I'm looking forward to getting into some sun. Let's do it. All right, so now we're through security and not long before we board our plane. So let's get it. Okay, which is the best water? Is it the box then? Or do we go for the Evian? Or do we go for the smart water? Always have to get a bottle of water before I get on a flight. Which one should we get? And of course, you have to get that pre-flight breakfast. And yes, in the end, I went for the smart water option. Keeping it nice, keeping it healthy. Okay, so yeah, so we have arrived in Turkey. I need to go to passport control now. Um, the queue is looking crazy and I'm not sure what is the fastest way to go. Um, this airport is huge, but yeah, we are in Turkey. So keep with me on this vlog and let's see how we get on. All right, so got through airport security and now I'm just heading down to my vehicle for my collection. So walk with me while I go there now on the escalators. Let's see this. It's a lot. This is a pretty large airport, as we can see. Now I'm heading out to the exit. I'm gonna go and collect my baggage. No, sorry. Heading to the exit and about to collect something. I don't know what that is, but it's not me. Not me. So I should be seeing my name on a board somewhere. Honestly, this airport is so huge. I actually don't know where I'm going, even though I was sent an instructional video for my collection to the car. I have no idea. Came out the wrong exit, but um, I can see the placards literally just seconds down the road. So I'm not gonna get the beautiful, big smiley welcome of people waiting for me on, with cards. Um, but because I now have to go through the back entrance to get to the placard section, which is annoying. Um, but it's my own fault for leaving that exit. All right, so yeah, hopefully my car still, <laughs> car still waiting for me, despite being about 15, 20 minutes late. Um, yeah, let's see. Hold on. I wanna speak, come, come. No, sorry. Where are you going? I got a taxi ready. Got a taxi ready. Um, who do I, I speak to for CEO 34? Yeah, already have a booking, T. What's your name, sir? T. E. E. Yeah? This one? There it is. I thought, I thought the car would be right outside the door, but of course, that's not possible for health and safety reasons. All right, so just waiting for the car to pull up and then I'll get in my car and head on my journey towards my hotel. Um, I think it's a 45 minute to one hour journey to the European side of Istanbul and then I'll get to my hotel shortly. Um, so, a little story about the last time I came to Turkey. So, I came to Turkey quite a while ago now, to be fair, but the last time I came, literally 30 times a day minimum, I was called Bob Marley, Bob Marley. So I'm very intrigued to see, have things changed, have people moved forward <laughs> in this country now. So, let's see what happens for the next few days. Just to add a little bit more context to that story, um, I, this is my first time in Istanbul. The last time I came was to a completely different part of Turkey. So yeah, I think they already, already arrived. So, so yeah, my car's arrived now and instantly got the same Bob only thing. Yeah. Go, oh, thank you. Thank you. It's going here, yeah? Okay. 
Let's see what's happening. Okay, this is my car. This is my private transfer. Thank you. That's correct. Yes. Thank you. Okay, so I'm in the car. First person I came across already got a call about money. So no, Turkey has not moved forward. But yes, we are in the transfer now. I won't record this whole drive, but let's have a look at the vehicle that I am in. Um, my little private vehicle. Got some baby wipes there. Um, some LED lights as well. Not bad. And leather sofa. And some other bits and bobs here. Yeah. Not too bad. Not too bad at all. Give me a little tour. The van. There we go. Yeah, so it's not too bad. It should be a comfortable drive. Um, let's see how we get on. I will see you when I arrive at the hotel. Okay, so we've now arrived. Let's leave out this. Leave out this. Ugh. Let's leave out. We're here now. Okay. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Hey. Ah, oh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Let me get my food as well. Straight through here. Yeah, sure. Oh yeah, okay, thank you. So, just arrived at the hotel. Got a couple of leaflets, things to do, Turkish night show. Um, just got this met there, also the owner um, of the hotel as well. This is a brand new hotel, as you can see. Um, very, very beautiful in here. Um, yeah, lots of shiny things. Um, so yeah, looking forward to staying here and seeing what my stay at the Mist Park Hotel is like. Water upon arrival as well, very nice. And then you can see the sun is blazing. Um, so yeah, join me in the Mist Park Hotel, or Mist Park actually, I think I'm actually pronouncing that just a little bit incorrect. But yeah, we're here now and let's go inside. Okay, so this is our hotel room, room 501. As I mentioned earlier, we are at the Mitt Spark Hotel. And I say we, I. <laughs> and um, this is a brand new hotel here in Turkey, Istanbul. As you can see, everything is looking shiny, fresh, clean and brand new. It's not the largest space, but for just me being here, um, it's more than adequate enough. And I like, you know, um, simple but luxury things so it has lots of um, technological advancements in this room you know nice little TV there which probably won't use much um, a mini bar with some water in there safe to keep things safe of course a couple of hangers to hang your clothing and of course the beds are made up very nicely here very nicely with the rose petals and the double bed and the mirror um i am actually on the ground floor which is interesting um, first time i've been ground floor in a hotel the view outside is um yeah it's nothing to shout about but i can see sun and then let's have a quick look into the bathroom which again looks very very plush in here as well brand new um toilet not bad standalone wash basin um, privacy blinds, a mirror, and of course, a shower. Um, shower and no bath, which is fine, which is fine for the amount of time that I'll be here. Um, let's see where the lights are for this actually. Let's get these lights on in the bathroom so we can get a better view. I don't know how to even turn on the lights. Yeah, I'm pressing all the buttons and there is absolutely no i'm guessing it's this here no it's not that okay so we're just we're just going to be in darkness in the shower um, because the lights switch is nowhere to be seen but you do get um, some free items in here um, which is good and it's one of those overhead 
shower heads everything is shiny fresh and clean um, and this is interesting um, if I did have a guest here um, you can see <laughs> them on the toilet um, of course there is thankfully blinds you can pull down here um, but if not if you want to be a voyager and just watch someone on the toilet you can do that in this room um, so yeah enjoy so this is my room and um, yeah day one in Turkey let's see how it goes I'm also gonna actually put up a Bob Marley counter on on the screen as well um, so far we have had one Bob Marley's um, so let's see if we can get less than I done last time which was at least 30 per day let's see how it goes but I may not be as active in this holiday this is about relaxing um, chilling out and recharging so let's see how it goes okay so now getting into the lift getting into the lift and where am i going where am i going okay so let's explore the hotel a little bit and see what it has to offer let's see what is in the hotel and what we can do so i'm heading down to guess what floor yes floor number three which i believe is the highest floor in this hotel and let's see what is on that floor hopefully it's not busy up here okay all right let's see what's out here so okay it has a little roof terrace here um let's flip this around okay oh the sun is popping here this is beautiful i may come up here very often so this is actually really nice a nice little feature of the hotel it has a roof terrace very little quaint petite one and you get an amazing view of Istanbul the camera probably is not doing it justice but you actually do get to see quite far over um, all of Istanbul all the buildings and onto the ocean um, if I turn the camera a little bit over here you can see again more views all over the shoreline you have some chairs and the Sun is hitting me beautifully right now uh, if you can actually let me show you guys I'm not sure if you can see but it's the way the Sun is just hitting my face this is what I came for this is what I came for this is beautiful yes so I will be taking off these clothes and getting just more chilled and fully into holiday mode because the Sun is blazing today I think it's about 29 degrees and even though I'm not burning up I'm quite good with heat I'm not super hot um, I can feel that when I start walking I will at least take off this keep my t-shirt on and yeah get some sun rays into my skin so yeah let's see let's see let's see what Istanbul has to offer so join me okay you know I don't like seeing all these dogs just flying around seeing all these dogs just flying around um, yeah it is a little bit disconcerting I'm not used to this loose dogs on the loose but it's all good it's all good they, they seem very very friendly there's so many food places here though I may not need to go too far to get some food um, just a little update on, on what's been happening since I gave you that tour of the hotel room. Um, my plan was to actually go out and explore the city um, in the peak of the heat and I fell asleep. It, it was that comfortable. It was that comfortable. I actually fell asleep and I was unable to get up. I tried to wake up so many times and I couldn't get I don't know how long I was asleep for but I was absolutely exhausted. The flight was only three hours in the end, 40 minutes before, but it was three hours in the end. Um, thank you. And um, yeah, I did wake up very early for this flight and I didn't actually get much sleep. So maybe that's why I'm, but this is why I'm here on holiday to rest, recharge and reset. So we're doing what we need to do. Um, yeah, all right. So I can see around the corner, we have a nice ice cream spot. I will be going there at some point. This guy's about to try and sell me some perfume. I will be ignoring oh okay it's not sending it to me it's sending it to these guys it's sending it to these guys all right so where do i turn do i go straight or go left oh all right <laughs> i'm going straight down here what do i see i see water i see the ocean that palm tree nice um i never mercedes made back van I'm not sure. I'm not sure if it's really Maybach, but 
Yeah. This guy's about to try and give me his perfume. Um, I'm, I'm good. I'm good. Thank you. No worries. No worries. No worries. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I'm trying to send me that Christian Dior Savage for 10 euro. It looks legit though, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I believe that it is legitimate because that would be a absolutely bargain price. But yeah, I better open it and it smells different to what I'm used to with the premium EDP or the perform. Hello, brother. I can help you, brother. It's all right. I can show you, brother. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, all right. So that's one thing I remember about Turkey is 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 the um yeah they don't just kind of almost leave you to decide if you want to come into the vicinity or, or, or the store they actually yeah they're very almost forceful about it but it's fine i'm used to i'm used to that life I'm used to that life it looks like they really do catch the fish directly straight out of the water there's a bunch of people on the shoreline with their fishing lines to be fair turkish food is probably one of my favorite cuisines of all time um it's just so tasty but also so healthy at the same time normally they use very fresh ingredients and they have a good mixture of proteins veg and carbs just the right you know percentages for each for each thing so yeah i will be looking forward to my for my eating habits out here for certain so yeah let's go get some food Woo! that was the hello yeah, say hello. <laughs> hello, hello, it's Turkey. <laughs> yes, welcome to Turkey. Hello. <laughs> Thank you for the hello. Thank you for the welcome. Appreciate that. Bye bye. Yeah, that was very. See, I like that. Nice and friendly, um, as opposed to the usual of Mali messages. Very friendly guy. Love that. Um, he will make the video. Um, even though he was half naked, hopefully YouTube doesn't ban me for that. All right, so this family here, or this group of people, having a full-on barbecue right next to the ocean with the cats on deck as well. This looks like an absolute vibe, vibe, jeez. Y'all need me some friends, that's what I need. That's what I need. Right, so I've come to a conundrum. Do I go left or do I go right? I'm not gonna lie, left is looking like more shoreline, so let's go somewhere different. Right side looking more like sh more shoreline, so let's go to the left um, through this area, and hopefully I can make some sort of route back towards my hotel. It will be potentially a longer route, but this looks like a very nice walk as well. Lots of greenery here yeah this is this holiday is already a vibe liking what i'm seeing liking what i'm seeing just need to get some good food now and a good sleep and i'm ready for day two ready for day two yeah honestly honestly it's it's a vibe man so vibe, everyone's just out on the grass, watching the shoreline, watching the ocean, watching the waves crash, and just taking in a bit of the last bit of sun of this evening before the sun sets in about 30, 35 minutes ish, as you may can see in the background. Um, in this lovely little walkway with greenery, what do we have in front of us? Yes, we have the Turkish flag blowing away in the wind um, in deep red. This actually looks really, really nice as well um, amongst all of the greenery here. And this big red turkey flag is flying. Very, very nice touch indeed. Okay, so we're approaching this. Oh, I thought it was a bridge, just a slight hill. Where, oh, what? Oh, what is this? What is this? This is, um, this is 
it looks like a park. I can't, I can't tell. You have to pay to get through here. I'm, I'm gonna drive. I'm gonna walk through here and see, see what is actually occurring. So, let's see. Let's see. <clears throat> yeah, I don't know. I'm seeing gates. So I'm, I'm hoping it's just a little park that I can walk through and take a different route back to my accommodation. That's what I'm hoping. Um, but yeah, we shall see. It is a bit of a hill. And I am feeling it on my on my legs <laughs> right now. So I have a twenty four so I have a twenty five minute walk back to the hotel from here through this park. So let's see what this park has to offer. Got a little tank here. Um, this park has lots of security for some reason. There's a, there's a police officer here with an AK forty seven or assault rifle or whatever that that gun is. Um, so yeah. But this park is looking like, it's looking like it's one of them. Oof, there's so many, so many, so many ways in this park you can go. It's a bit of a maze. This cat has his tail up, so that means he's very happy. Very happy. Oh, he knows this food. Oh, they know this food. Look at them. Oh, they got raw fish. Nice. They're getting raw fish. Yeah, raw fish. We got they got too much, too much now. I don't even know what to even don't know where to even start. Uh, limited food. This man just gave this man just blessed him. Raw fish and now he's like, what do I do? I got too much options. But anyway. Let's see. This park is very well landscaped for sure. I like what they've done with the bushes. Obviously it's autumn now, so lots of brown leaves on the floor, which to be fair, it does make it extra vibe, but it would look nicer without all of that. Um, and what did they say? Gul, Gul, Gulhan or Gulhen? Um, yeah, okay. All right, so I do wonder what else is this park has to offer. Got some little water features here in this park. Let's see what these are saying. Little water features here in this park. Nice little bridge here as well to get across. Okay. Yeah, man, the settings of this park. Pretty nice, pretty cool. They bring a sense of calm and zen for sure okay so we're about to exit the gates at the ever end of the park um i can hear music I hope this ain't copyrighted it sounds like an original piece to me though um and they're selling okay selling corn in a cup nice some freshly made is that, is that bagels or whatever that is over there okay see this is what I was looking for this is what I was looking for I was looking for the hot spot where everything's at and I'm seeing everything around here this is looking like it's a yeah this is this is looking like where everything is they got cafes they got restaurants got all the shops all the bazaars and the question is do i go um all the way left up here of this hill or do i go slightly to the right up here where i'm seeing the majority of people <laughs> yep some more friendly people there i don't know if they're on holiday or they're from turkey but little gift shop here Probably nothing in here I'm gonna buy, so I'm gonna not waste anyone's time and um, and make like a tree and leave. Actually, before I do leave, let me look over here. Uh, what is this? Is that sweets or food? Yeah, sweets or food, fam? That's sweets. Oh, that oh the tea bags. That looks really really tasty. 
it's really, really tasty. Okay, nice. Okay. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> no, no, no. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I'm here. <laughs> a few, a few, a few, a little bit. <laughs> yeah, yeah, not many, not many. <laughs> I'm ready to eat and go back. And up there looks very busy as well. So, yeah, there's so many places to explore, but as the saying goes, Rome wasn't built in a day and Turkey will not be explored in a day. So let me go and get some food and then go back to the hotel and actually rest today so I can enjoy the rest of my trip. Okay, let's go. But this, this square is looking very, very, very busy. Very busy, but some beautiful scenery um, I can see here. Beautiful scenery here. Okay, so yeah, I'll definitely come back to this area and explore at some point. But I think for now, for now, I will most certainly, I'm only four minutes away from the hotel apparently, so I'm quite close to this. So I will be going back to a restaurant, eating some food. So catch you on the other side, guys. Peace. So finally chose somewhere to sit and eat for dinner. Let's see what this is saying. Um, I'm not going to record myself eating the dinner, of course, but I'm sat down and I'm waiting for my food to arrive. I have an empty plate here, so let's see. Part of my food has arrived. Um, I have this thing here. I'm not, can someone please tell me what this is? I have absolutely no idea what this is. Um, no idea, it looks very oily. I've also got a basket of bread now as well, so this should be, this should be a vibe. Should be cool. Okay, more food of mine arriving. Oh, salad. Yep. Thank you very much. Oh, thank you very much. I'm my fork. I put my food here. So I, as you can see, I have chips, a bit of chicken, a bit of rice, a um, bit of salad, and of course the bread. Also, yeah. Let's let's talk into this. Let's... Okay. And now the Turkish tea has just arrived. So let's try this out. I actually never had Turkish tea before. Not be my thing. But got my, got a little friend here as well. Who's just been sat here next to me for about ten minutes. I did give him a piece of my food, but now he won't leave me alone. <laughs> Little cute cat. <laughs> okay, let's try this Turkish tea now again. Okay, pretty cool, pretty cool. Um, yeah, decent. You know, it's good. It's always good practice to have a hot drink after eating. Helps with digestion as well. So, yeah, first time trying Turkish tea, and so far, I like it. I like it. Okay, so just finished dinner um, and now I'm gonna walk back to the hotel. Um, as you can see, it's now dark. Um, leaving the restaurant, I wish I had the camera on for this, but I just had the most random, random conversation. Um, a conversation that cannot be, re be, re be repeated on YouTube for sure. But this guy was talking to me for about five minutes, asking me a bunch of questions. Obviously, I'm being nice and just, you know, talking and entertaining him. But some of the things he was saying, um, again, in relation to my race and color, very interesting. Um, yeah, definitely can't repeat them here, but it was, um, yeah, very strange conversation. I'm not, I, can't, I can't tell if he was, he was being serious or if he was joking or what or trying to be funny. But he was partially trying to get me to go to his carpet store maybe make some money but he was i'm not sure if he's trying to build rapport with me or something but wow interesting way to do it um but yeah i'm now fed um the one thing i haven't seen to be fair and i haven't explored a lot but the one thing i have not seen yet is any stores to get some groceries snacks things like that because um i may get peckish in the middle of the night in the hotel um maybe too late now and i really cannot be bothered to walk around anymore um but Maybe I should do it, but let me show you my surroundings. So out here, still really busy. Um, there's a mask over there, lit up, and there's a bunch of people still walking around the square at the moment. Um, so yeah, it is hopping around here at the moment. Now, you know what? I am gonna go and try and find something very quickly. I'm not, I'm not gonna, hey. I'm not going to walk too far, but I'm going to go and try and find some sort of snacks very quickly to walk because I need something tonight for the hotel. So 
yeah, let's let's go and find something. <laughs> and now, and now I'm being um. <laughs> Now some kids uh, have just asked me, I'm not sure if you guys heard that, but some kids just asked me, is that KSI? Honestly, <laughs> do, I, do I look anything like KSI? <laughs> and they're just, stare, they're just staring me out. Anyway. Um... Hi, Mike. Hey, you all right? Yes. Maybe. Hey, <laughs> Thank you, thank you. Thank you, thank you. You're right. You want a G with big voice. <laughs> okay, let's go on. Hello, buddy. How are you? Hi. Meow. Where are you from? London. London. And then, yeah, and then, man. All right, man. It's like some Kobe here. Happy hour right now. Last be 110, Robert. Yeah, not today, not today. Sorry. Not today, not today. But another day, maybe. Okay, man. Thank you, thank you. You have nice year, eh, brother? Thank you, thank How many you. Years? My whole life. <laughs> whole life. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, thank you. See you some any other time. Yes, for sure. Thank you. Oh. All right, hopefully, hopefully you guys are still with me. Um, no Bob Marley comments yet, though, um, in the city. Just a few comments about my hair. Um, twice there in the space of 10 seconds. Um, but yeah, let's see, let's see, let's see, let's see. Hello, my friend. Hello, you're right. Hi. Yes, 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 yes. Very nice. Oh, I just, I just ate, I just ate. What do you ate? I'm walking back. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, sorry. Thank you, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, so, um, Anyway, back to what I was saying. Um, yeah, I'm gonna go back and um, travel back to my accommodation now. Um, and yeah, gonna go and make some. You know what? I'm, I'm starting to get. Here is my place, brother. I just had some food already. Yes, yes. We have also nice shisha here. Okay. Maybe okay. On the way back, you know, we can visit my lovely place. You know, here is our place. You know. Okay. Nice come for us. We have also nice shisha, brother. Yeah. All right. What's thank your you. Name? Tea. Nice to meet you, brother. Yeah. No, no, that's all right. <laughs> honor. My name's honor. Yeah, you see, honor. Thank you. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Yes. Um, all right. Okay. So, time to go get some dessert now. Um, hopefully, um, they are better. Actually, let's see. Before we even get it, let's see. The, let's actually see the price first. Um, let's see what the price is saying first. Yeah. You know what? Let's get. Let's get a small scoop. Yeah, let's get, let's get, let's get, let's get medium scoop. Is it card? Yes. Okay. Can I get um a medium scoop, please? Mix. Yeah, strawberry and blue. Yeah, strawberry and blue. Oh, oh, oh what is this? <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. <laughs> I'm gonna get it. Okay, not this time. Okay, okay, uh, okay. Still not got it. Okay, no, still waiting. Hey, uh, <laughs> come on. <laughs> no, 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 thank you very much. Okay. Okay. So, honestly, wow, this ice cream is very 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 tasty um, i'm sorry to be eating on camera but the flavors are something else i didn't expect it to be so nice um i got as, as i was said earlier i got the blue whatever blue is the blue is the best one and strawberry and the flavor is something else so what i'm gonna do now i'm gonna enjoy this ice cream i'm gonna lock in and then i'm gonna make my journey back to the hotel i, do, I don't know where i'm going it's getting very dark now so um i need to get back and see what this route back to the hotel is is it somewhere easily walkable is it lit is it safe so all this is on my doorstep apparently all of this is on my doorstep i am very close to my hotel now apparently and i had no idea this was around the corner so that tells me that earlier today i definitely took a wrong turn well not a wrong turn but just not as an exciting turn that's for sure <laughs> but we're not far from my accommodation which is great and you can see i got the lays that's what you always get abroad all right so i'm gonna turn it right here oh i don't know if i'm turning right here 
think I might be turning right here. I am turning right here. Down these crazy stairs. Okay. Fantastic. Let me just show you these stairs. Quite steep. Quite steep stairs and dark. But this is the only way to get back to my hotel. But yeah, good to know that I'm close to the vibrant city. I may, I may spend one day with no camera, no nothing, just me and my ones exploring because I want to explore freely. For sure, for sure. A little cat down here. See them? Okay, yeah. Okay, there's, there's something here talking about a Turkish bath and massage. This is exactly what I'm looking for. Um, but where, where is this sign from? Where is the sign from? It says info reception, but where's the reception? Where's the reception? Is the reception in this hotel? Let's go, let's, let's go in here and see what, what, what's happening. Okay, there's no one in here. No one, there's no one in here, it's quiet. Empty. Oh, sorry, hi. Um, I saw the sign outside, is, is that for here? The, about the uh, massage in Turkish bath? Yes. Okay, what's the prices and the, just, just inquiring? It includes uh, bath, massage program together. That means 30 minutes traditional Turkish bath, within 15 minutes rice scrub for full body and 15 minutes uh, for massage on the hard marble stone, like you know, Turkish style like this. Yep. Plus 30 minutes oil massage. Okay. So that means you will uh, come from the bath like a baby. Yeah, yeah. That. You know. Actually, I recommend for you to do it. Yeah. Um, before your sleep. Okay. Before bath, you need to eat. Yeah. And then go bath and then go What time is it close? Um, What's the latest time I can go? Let me check. Okay, so we're back at the hotel. Um, yeah. Let me get my. Hi. Hi, hi. Very good, thank you. Yes. We are back in the room. So that wasn't so bad. Um, but yeah, back in the room, and it's time for me now to get a great night's rest. Peace. So, day one recap. So where did we start off? We started off, of course, in the UK, very early start, traveling to the airport. And we caught a flight which um, was mostly smooth. I expected it to be four hours. It ended up only being three hours, which interesting. I'm not sure what that's about. Maybe they factor in the fact that it takes around 20 minutes a taxi from landing to the actual gate and then walk to the airport security. Maybe they factor all that in, because that did take around 30, an additional 30, 40 ish minutes as well. Um, yeah, got into Turkey, of course. Um, we saw the hotel, I fell asleep, and then I've done a little bit of exploration around the Istanbul city and discovered some new things, and of course, had some dinner. And now I'm back at the hotel, um, ready to relax and rest and maybe book some excursions um i think tomorrow i may have a turkish bath and spa um which should be quite intriguing for sure um yeah definitely looking forward to that so gonna look into that join me on day two and let's see what i get up to peace now i'm going upstairs like if you don't see me again, it's because I've been taken, kidnapped by a random Turkish guy. Trying to, kick, trying to kidnap me, trying to, trying to get me to sit down and close the door. You're having a joke, fam. <laughs> 